How much do you know about Huawei? If you're in the US, chances are you've never even held a Huawei device in your hand. That's a shame because the company makes some great phones, like the new Mate 10. The Mate 10 is distinct. It doesn't look too much like an iPhone or a Samsung Galaxy. It's pretty wide, which sounds like a bad thing, but it actually helps it to stand out and feel less fragile than a lot of other phones. Plus, its 5.9 inch screen is beautiful. On the inside is Huawei's Kirin 970 processor. The phone is about as fast as competition from Samsung and Google, and it's equipped with a neural processing unit, which Huawei says helps power its AI tomfoolery. The phone uses this AI power to help conserve battery and shoot pretty photos. It's a mixed bag here, as the battery life, while good, isn't as strong as the Samsung Galaxy Note 8, or, weirdly, even Huawei's Mate 10 Pro, which has the same size battery. But, the phone sure does take some nice photos. It can identify between 13 different scenes, like person or flower, and optimize the camera accordingly. How much this actually helps is hard to tell, but the lack of branded cameras are among the best out there. Here's the kicker though, the Mate 10 will be hard to find. You can't officially buy it in the US or the UK, but it is available in Australia for $900 it is. If you want a big screen phone and find Samsung, Apple and Google's offerings too pricey, the Mate 10 is worth the hassle.